Hello, hi everyone. This is Shreeja, and welcome back to my channel. Now, today's video is not about skincare. It's not about hair care. It is actually uh, about my Surya Namaskar challenge that I have been doing. If you don't follow me on Instagram, then let me um, give you guys a little background. So, from last one month, like I have, uh, I'm someone. I honestly have this overall approach. to skin care and health i believe in moving my body every day i love working out i believe in eating healthy i believe in sleeping regularly and having like consistent sleep patterns and of course then there is skin care like i think uh, you know you need to take care of your overall body like what you are from inside sort of reflects on the outside and of course like your mental health as well like you can't ignore that like you know we all know that stress has a direct relationship to acne and other skin problems so i feel like a healthy skin is like an overall reflection of everything i think skin care is just like a small uh, part of the puzzle uh, and you need to pay attention to other areas like as well so i started this uh, 108 surya namaskar challenge uh, last month wherein i was doing 108 surya namaskars in 30 minutes every single day and today i'm just here to talk about my personal experience with you all so uh, this is the video that i actually followed for the counting and stuff um, i'll also link the video for your reference if you guys are interested um, and you want to maybe start the challenge but anyway so like uh, for me uh, you know i have been working out i remember my journey uh, my fitness journey actually started when i was 22 a little more than 21 actually i was and i think by 22 i was like still like i to say i think maybe when i was like yeah i think it's it started on my like post my 21st birthday when uh, like i gained approximately 10 kilos and you know before that like i have always been blessed with like a very good metabolism and i used to not care my diet was like i used to eat anything and like you know not gain weight and my idea of fitness was very flawed where i where and i sort of related it to uh you know being skinny is equivalent to being fit which is by the way one of the most flawed concepts ever no it's not because i could not even run for 2 minutes i had uh, like my stamina was so bad i had breathing issues and things like that so i started working out when i was 22 i am 27 by the way so um it's been almost like 6 years and i have not stopped working out so initially of course when i went to the gym like my goal was to lose weight and all of those external things like things that you do for vanity but now i think working out is a lot of like it's a part of my um it's as normal for me as eating and breathing i don't think i there are there is like i don't like i work out almost every single day except of course when i have rest days i'll do like a bit of stretching and stuff but i enjoy working out that much so uh you know um i was so um post covid like before covid i used to go to the gym a lot then post covid i started working out at home i used to do strength training pilates yoga a combination of these like i make my own workouts every day i also have like a workout highlight on my instagram page in case you guys want to start your workout journey because i regularly post my daily workouts there all the videos everything like you know everything is linked so it's easier for you in case you want to start and you can do it all at home and of course it's like free all those videos are free so um what happened was i was doing my strength training everything like was it was going fine but like somehow i felt that you know i needed to shake things a bit and surya namaskar is something that i always struggled with like i have been doing yoga but uh you know i was not able to do like maybe 20 in a go so i was like no let me take this as a challenge and let me do 108 surya namaskar for 30 single days and let's see like how my body reacts and i'm telling you i think this is one of the best challenges that i have ever done and i know uh, when you're first starting to work out you want to know about physical results maybe that will help you with that motivation and then you can sort of like you know once you're working out then you really don't care then honestly it becomes a part of your lifestyle so after 30 days and i'm telling you i was eating like my diet was normal i do eat out two to three times in a week of course i'm a human being and i love food i do eat like a small piece of cake homemade cake which has like healthy things like oat and stuff or like a small piece of cho chocolate every day after lunch because i have a sweet tooth and that is the time when i crave crave sugar so i'll have like a small uh, piece of it so i was actually doing everything as i normally would i just incorporated surya namaskar into my daily lifestyle 108 every single day 
and I also went on like two trips during this time and of course I was eating out a lot you know when you're on trips you're like uh, eat out a lot there was this occasional drinking involved and things like that but I still managed to lose about three inches from my waist and I took approximately three to four kilos and like my goal was not even that like you know honestly just because uh, the reason I'm telling you this is because uh, I know when you're starting a workout journey you need something external to be motivated for me uh, I just started it because I wanted to do it so that was it like that's why I'm not going to be like putting out all these before after and things that like like that's not me to be honest uh, even I was like for the longest time I was wondering like should I share this but the only reason I'm sharing this is because uh, I know it will act as a motivator if you want to start your fitness journey so yeah two to three inches and uh, like yeah, three to four kilos that is and this is the only change that I made Mind you, I'm not someone who follows calorie deficit or anything. I eat like, yes, of course, I plan my diets accordingly, like where I'm eating home cooked meals, like my breakfast is usually South Indian dosa or I'll eat poha or like sandwiches and things like that. So I was eating everything. I was not restricting myself. And still I was like, this was like, my mind was blown. I'm like, why is this happening? Like, why is my jeans getting, only then I measured myself because I could feel that my clothes are like getting a bit like, you know, from my waist. It would, it was not fitting. Like it was just drooping down. So that's when I realized. And um, apart from this, of course, my flexibility increased. I was sleeping so much. Like I do sleep well, but with this, like I used to be so tired. Like by the day, anyway, I had, had had a very hectic schedule. But I, I felt that my sleep pattern was much better. Um, and overall, I was much more at peace like I cannot explain it this is something that I felt internally like I felt I was so much calmer like uh, I face so many like even though you know with like when you're a content creator you have your own business there are a lot of, lot of lots of ups and downs which you won't see in the camera which I have to go through every single day but I was able to deal with it in such a better way I was like a calmer person I was I don't know I just felt like overall like my quality of life sort of improved and I feel like so of course I'm not going to do it every day now but I'm going to definitely keep it in my routine like workout routine I'm going to do it every alternate day and uh, because I love it so much and now I want to sort of of course get back to my regular workout routine and things so the point of this video is like a lot of times you know you guys ask me can you give us a serum for that glow for the cream like you know a cream or like you know what can i do for my fine lines and wrinkles um i'll tell you what of course skincare can help to an extent but working out is the best decision that you will actually make for your body and you know on instagram i regularly get messages from people when they're like oh you have motivated me to work out like this is what i'm doing and i feel so happy because even if i'm motivated like if after watching this video even say one of you sort of incorporate this into your life like my job is done that is what my true role as an influencer sort of comes and I think apart from this I'll tell you what like there are other things that I actually regularly do for my health for my health okay like people always ask me oh how will it benefit your skin and hair skin and hair comes first but you need to take care of your overall health and that is one thing is that drinking methi water every single morning this is something that I have been incorporating like it's almost more than a year now and I feel it just like it sort of controls your blood sugar level of course like if you have other underlying medical conditions do consult your doctor before consuming it but drinking methi water regularly having nuts uh, you know having uh, food rich in um, fatty like you know good fats like avocados also ghee uh, I think it makes a lot of difference and of course having like a consistent sleep pattern and your overall lifestyle like for me I have never smoked in my life I like that's a big no for me like I'm telling you honestly it's such a turn off for me like if you're just smoke <laughs> I don't know like for me even if somebody's smoking around me like I do tell them like I have friends who smoke but like I do tell them that if you're around me you have to like maybe like you know stand away from me or I'll maybe just stand like a distance has to be maintained because that is something I cannot tolerate because I'm telling you smoking leads to of course, it impacts your health in a very bad way and it leads to direct collagen loss in the body and pigmentation issues around mouth, if you guys want to know about the skin effects. And drinking is also something that I do occasionally. I'm a very occasional, like very social drinker. It's not something that I enjoy. Uh, apart from that, I think I eat everything. I consume dairy, I consume gluten. I don't have any issues, any allergies, apart from lemon allergy. So yeah, I do stay away from lemon, but that is a diagnosed allergy that I have. and whenever I consume lemon it sort of freaks me out and I cannot take vitamin C supplements but that is it so like the point of this video is that of course skincare is important but there are other things that are also like 
I would say not also. I, there are other things that are more important. You need to take care of your body. You need to take care of your sleep patterns. And yeah, so that is all I have for you guys today. If you have any questions regarding my Surya Namaskar challenge or my workout, please feel free, free to drop them in the comments below. And I do recommend checking out my Instagram workout highlights uh, if you want to start your workout journey because like that can be really helpful. So yeah, that is all. And I'll see you next time. Bye.